Every day, every night, 365 days a year, men and women of all colors, backgrounds, and ability from across this country are donning bulletproof vests, radios, first aid kits, and gun belts to walk our sidewalks, drive down our alleys, and climb our darkened stairways. Our job is to respond to and help the citizens of this nation when they need it, and we routinely do without hesitation. No one in law enforcement desires to harm anyone. No one expects to, but it will happen because from time to time, situations develop unexpectedly that creates and causes harm. The notion that there exists in this nation's law enforcement community a pervasive culture of antagonistic racism is a fiction. Lately, the police have been having a hard time with some very bad press coverage. But this is a time when the press do not often reflect the true sentiment of the citizenry. In Ms. Price's social studies class at Vance Middle School, the assignment was to write letters to the Bristol, Tennessee Police Department officers. These are a few of those letters. Dear men and women who protect Bristol, my heart goes out to you all. You risk your life so, so that citizens of Bristol can stay safe. My respect is put forth to you all. Thank you for protecting the town, my school, and my family. You are greatly honored with what you do, and I want you to know that every time I see or hear your sirens, I pray for you and the victims or wrongdoers, because whoever they are or you may be, God forgives, and I pray that he'll touch a life. You work very hard for very little, and I wanted to say thank you. You desire more respect than what you get, so I know I am just one person, but you have my full respect. Great job with what you do. Dear Bristol, Tennessee Police Department, thank you for all you have done in order to protect Bristol. You all have taken a lot of heat from the public, but in the end, you gave 100% to protect us, and that's all you could ask for. I've heard all the rumors, but we believe in you, and I trust you 100%. You arrest thieves and stop hackers, take down invasions. When I'm in trouble, you, you're there to save me. When anybody needs you, you're there. Thank you for that. Thank you so much for protecting our city. Without you, we would not be safe. And that's from one of my classmates, Laura Lavender. I need to tell you how much I appreciate all that you do. Yes, people are putting you guys down about other mistakes, that people make mistakes. All police officers do not need to be blamed. Remember, you are awesome and keep doing what you're doing. You guys make me feel safe. You're my hero. Also, thank you. You risk your life every day to protect the people that do nothing for you in return. You do all you can, leave your family and friends every day not knowing if you will come home. You risk your life for us to keep us safe and ask for nothing in return. Thank you with all my heart. I know you will, I know you, with you out there protecting the city that I am safe. Dear Bristol, Tennessee Police Department, thank you for everything you do for our city. Thank you for your time spent for keeping everyone safe. Also, thank you for making great decisions in the little time you may have. The city of Bristol, Tennessee thanks you for your service. Mackenzie, thank you. We appreciate your hard work. With all the media coverage and um, just information going out from a lot of the cases in the nation, I felt like our local police needed some encouragement. And that day I just decided at the end of my lesson to take about 25 minutes of class to have the kids create cards if they wish to make cards for the police department. And the neat thing was that morning I had no clue it was Officer Appreciation Day. And during the announcements, they made an announcement to make sure we thanked Officer Yuri because of Officer Appreciation Day. And then I thought to myself, well, this was meant to be. This was meant to happen. So I knew it was a good idea. So uh, at the end of each class, I asked the kids um, if they would like to, to create cards for Officer Appreciation Day, uh, just to give them their support. And I shared with them a little of the background about how at times the media will, will present cases and a lot of times people in professions will often um, maybe suffer persecution because of a particular incident and that we have to be careful not to judge professions based on one or two incidences and draw conclusions just based on media. So uh, I just shared with them how our local police do so much for us and I pointed out that many of our students have family members who are in the police department and they were very responsive uh, and it was given as a free choice so the kids uh, got excited about it, looked up shields and they mm -hmm. wrote in their own words and just expressed how they felt about the police department how much they appreciated what they do for Bristol.
The letters made a big impact on the police officers. Well, it was very important to the officers. The officers uh, ended up receiving, I think it was about 83 cards and letters from the seventh grade advanced middle school that uh, told them they appreciated what they do, they recognize the service they give, they also understand that uh, not everything you see and hear on TV and in news media is accurate and they just wanted to know our personnel were appreciated and um, when we received those we started putting them in emails to the officers and uh, every day that we send out a new one and we've been doing that for several days now and it's uh, been a, a super motivational tool to the personnel uh, and it's just it's just good to know you're appreciated and uh, we wanted to thank uh, Ms. Price in the seventh grade for taking the time uh, to uh, actually do that that card thank you card campaign that they did. Folks I'm Blaine Wade and with me is Major Tim Eads I'm the police chief for our city I know uh, some of you uh, recognize you uh, we're here to uh, it's a very special day for us we every year we pick a citizen at, to give a citizenship award this year your teacher is going to receive our Bristol Tennessee Police Department citizenship award and also her seventh grade class and what precipitated uh, this award are the 81 cards of support and appreciation uh, to our law enforcement officers. I want you to know that each one of your cards are being sent by email to all the police officers in our department. Uh, each one of them is reading your personal messages uh, and they, they're sharing it with their families. It's, a, it's really a big deal for them and that's something that that you might not realize that you made an impact, but you did. And uh, it's with our sincere appreciation uh, that we give this uh, to Ms. Price thank and your you. class. And uh, I want to thank you. I want to thank each of you personally. And uh, being a, you're a bright spot in other people's lives, you recognize uh, that uh, law enforcement officers are necessary in life. And uh, it's not perfect and there will be perfect but you recognize there's a lot of uh, fiction in the news media that, uh, that doesn't necessarily hold true for everybody. And whenever, whenever you see a group, police officers or other folks painted with a broad brush, you're smart enough to look through it, and I thank you. Well, thank you so much. Yes.